Okay. It's rather sunny out. I thought it was cloudy, but it's rather sunny. But let's talk about chasing trends. As you can see, I'm keeping safe. Before the video starts, please do not forget to actually smash subscribe down below and turn on that notification bell so you may join the notification squad and not miss a new upload from me here on the Incube guys. Also don't forget to like that, you know, that hit that like button because that does a long way to making the YouTube algorithm love us and continue to promote these videos and continue to give you guys the quality content that you want. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it guys. And with that, let's get on with this video. Becoming a filmmaker. Okay, found a shady spot and um, I've got about two minutes before it starts raining because it's actually pretty windy out and um, basically we're talking about trends today. Today, um, when you talk about trends, you know, chasing trends, it's a very, you know, important topic when it comes to filmmaking because a lot of filmmakers like to talk about how, you know, don't go with the flow, stay in a niche, do what you love, stuff like that and don't chase trends because you'll burn out. And I think this is really true. I think it's very important if you want to go further in the field not to chase trends. I think it's very important that in anything you do, anything you want to do in life generally, you want to make sure you're doing it to the best of your, to the best of your ability. You're not looking for trends to, you know, boost yourself up or to make it to the top. Do not comment about my zit. It's like, I know I can see it as well. Like, dude. Anyways, the thing is, when it comes to trends, you want to make sure that you're actually doing your best to stay away from trends because this is the thing, it's contradictory. You can make a trend and then you know you become the trendsetter and everything then you like there's a difference when you, when you chase trends for the wrong reason there are two types of people that chase trends there are people that chase trends and they only chase trends so they only do the thing that is like in season for that season and they don't really have a defined purpose or defined you know style or any and any or anything like that but there are people that chase trends based on what they're doing so let's say i'm taking videos of landscaping then there's a trend that's coming out about how you can take like a certain landscape type shot if i'm chasing the trend of landscaping or if my niche is landscaping and video and videography i can chase that trend within my niche so that i can actually boost myself and people know that okay within this niche that person so it's very important that as a videographer eh, so much wind as anything in life basically you want to make sure that you are not actually focusing on the trend but you're focusing more on building your own talent building your own your own self as a person building your your image to become a strong image that one when, when, when people look at you they don't see the trend or they don't see anything else but they just see what you have to bring to the table they see your talent and they don't see just famous things that have gone by because people don't value people that only chase trends you won't have a voice for long and you can in fact lead to burnout so I mean chasing trends is good, trends are very good. I chase trends sometimes, trends are very good, but I feel like it's very important while you're chasing those trends to always make sure that you're doing it for the right reasons. And that's what I have to leave with you because it's actually not drizzling and um, the camera is not fully weatherproof so I can't exactly keep it off for long. That's all I have for you guys, you know? And yeah, I'm keeping safe because I decided I need some air so I, I left the house and just need some air, you know? And yeah, I'm outside, I'm not really at home so Keeping safe with the gloves and everything. Don't worry, no Verona Kais is gonna get me. But until next time, guys. No, in fact, not until next time. Until tomorrow, the Incubed.